doing a repeat of a repeat Dollar Tree haul just for you and me, of course. Anyway, I have everything opened. I've seen it all. It's not going to be a big surprise. Drat, drat. But I had two bags full of Dollar Tree, and I'll just kind of do a quick rewind of everything. You get to see it. So the iced oatmeal cookies from Little Dutch. I love these. You can eat two of them for 120 calories. Um, wonderful cookies. I think they're made in Austin, Texas, if I'm not wrong. Um... Uh, Abby Mar Foods, Abilene, Texas. Yes, these are delicious. I tried Dollar General's um, iced oatmeal, and they don't have as much frosting as Dollar Tree's. So these are better. I love them. Delicious cookies. I love uh, the grinders for peppercorns. So this was a great buy for $1.25. Uh, how many ounces of you got uh, 44 grams, one and a half ounces of peppercorns in a grinder. But I love ground pepper. I think that's the best way to go. Yes. And the Top Ramen, five packages. It's not a deal for $1.25. Yes, that's a great buy. And it's Top Ramen, which is, uh, you know, that's our favorite brand. Love Top Ramen. Max, you gonna come say hi? Come say hi to everybody. Yeah, over here. Oh, you're gonna do it down there? Max, say hi. Mm -hmm. Oh, Mr. Camera Shy. Oh, he did. Did he get on a little bit, maybe? Mm -hmm. Oh, he's crying about it. <sighs> Not happy. I love these crackers, the thin vegetable. I also bought the chicken ones, same company, Sobisk, made in India. These are delicious. Love them. Great buy. Great buy. Love these package mixes. Pillsbury uh, cheddar garlic. Yes, cheddar garlic biscuit mix. You just add uh, one half cup of milk and a third a cup of cheese, but I put in about a half a cup of cheese. 400 degrees for eight to 12 minutes. And you know, you need to, it says 12 to 14 biscuits. Um, I think and I get about nine, or maybe I get 12. Depends on how big your tablespoon is to put them out on the pan. But love this, really good. Bought two of those. Two, two, two. Got some tin foil, aluminum foil. Don't date myself. Aluminum foil, 25 square feet. This is the house brand. Probably thinner than Reynolds. Reynolds had 15 uh, square feet, so. I went for the house brand. 25 is better than 15. Don't really need it to be bulletproof either. Um, bought the Power Stick Antiperspirant. We've been pretty happy with this. It doesn't cause irritation. So that's that. I like getting the placards, the flossers at Dollar Tree. There's 60 in each one of these. This is the close up brand. This is the Grin. These are real nice. Um, we like the right angle better, but they didn't have right angle though. Kind of they call it for back teeth. But those are nice. My cats, my cats really love these. These are a good buy, three ounces for $1.25. Got chicken and seafood flavors for them. I got two seafood. I think they're partial to seafood. Fish, cats and fish. What is it with cats? Oh, a surprise find at Dollar Tree were um, the hand sanitizers are back. This is salted caramel. Um, I tested the salted, I bought two. This one is the sweeter smelling one and this is quite fragrant for the, the salted caramel. Then I got the apple one. This is uh, caramel apple scented. And here's the one I demonstrated on. It's a lighter. It's a nice uh, scent, odor. I'm fine with it. But why I like these so much is they, they don't really dry you out terribly. I made my own with alcohol, rubbing alcohol, and it's just like, it's so dry. So these are hydrating. Love them, very much so. Yes, buy them. Hope you can find them. Then I got a little special food bed, the Psychic Ball. Mm-hmm. I got a purple one, I got a blue one. I'm gonna give these as gifts. 
And here's the one I opened. I'm keeping this one for myself. The Psychic Vol. What's very cool, and I'm going to ask it a question. Is anybody going to watch this video? Uh, game on, it says. Game on. That's my answer. Okay, now let's do another one. That's no way. No, I didn't get that one. I got game on. So, yes, somebody's going to watch this, this video. But isn't this cute? So it has different remarks on that cube. I wonder if the bag says what it says. I don't think so. Come back here. Come back here, ball. Tried to run away. Tried to run away. Um, so this one says, uh, count it. No, doubt it. Doubt it. This one's for sure. Game on. Not clear. No way. And what's the bottom? Let me look at that. What's that one say? Ask. Ask later. Ask later. So, yeah, isn't that cool? All your different choices. Kind of a takeoff on your... Um, Magic 8-Ball. I think this is more fun, though. Plus, you got glitter. <gasps> Who doesn't like glitter? I love it. Then I got this other squishy ball. This is a stretch rainbow ball. Oh, yeah, that's interesting. Let's look at this. This looks really neat. Take it out of the package. Get it. Get it all by myself. Yeah, that's neat. It feels interesting. What in the world? What are the black spots? It's a ball with freckles. I don't get that. But it's stretchable. Yeah, that's kind of neat. Stress reducer. A fidget toy, for sure. That's interesting. There's something in here like, um, yeah, that's interesting. Maybe like a slime type of stuff in there. Can you see that? Let me do the green. I got sun coming in finally. Oh, yeah, there's sun. It's weird. It's weird what's in there. It's kind of like a, a pudding type of thing inside there. Probably akin to slime. Yeah, that's neat. That's neat. I'm a big kid. I am. Then I got some more of the makeup or the creams and stuff. This is the Glow Up Serum. Um, I'm using these for everything, you know, face, hands, whatever. But isn't this great? It's got a little pump applicator. There we got to get the straw filled up. Oops, there we go. There it is. Oh, that's a pleasant, uh, what is that? It's supposed to be watermelon? Watermelon extract and niacinamide. Niacinamide? Niacinamide. But anyway, I think it's helping all this creams and stuff. I think it's helping. Something nice to use. I'm not going to just use it on my face. I'm, you know, $1.25, I'm going to splurge. I am splurging. And they also have the Glow Up Toner. I've heard this is quite good. You want to try that? Um, what did I buy here? I bought... Uh, these are the Ioni. I got a lip plumper, and I tried it. It's not that drastic. I didn't think it was like... I bought another one from Dollar Tree that was a lot more... Plumpable, you know, you you know it's plumping because it's quite hot. They toned this one down though. This doesn't have the. It says hot alert. Feel the spicy heat. Get the pumped up, pumped lips. I'm not really feeling that. Ever so slight on that. Ever so slight. Yeah, ever so slight. I've, the other one they sold has been stronger. Then I also got this glitter shadow. It says a chameleon color. 
multi-dimensional chameleon effect, and this is blue. Um, mine is all broken up. I didn't notice it when I bought it, but it doesn't matter because I might use it like body glitter too. So, so it's kind of all get back in the back in the center there. Anyway, do a little bit of taste test or not taste test. Why I'm hungry, girl. Isn't that pretty? So you can see like purple and pink. It is very pretty in there. I don't know if you can tell. But nice. Very light. It's not, I don't think it's drastic dark. Then on to crafts. On to crafts. Um, my DIY did on the applique, the iron-on appliques from Timu. Loving them. I'm having so much fun jazzing up old shirts. Give them a fresh breath of life or whatever. That's not the right way how I want to say it. I always twist things. Um, breath of fresh air kind of type thing. But I bought some iron-on patches. Taco Tuesday, yes. And pizza. Who doesn't love pizza? With eyeglasses, no less. Love them. Got this one, baby, with the pearls. You know, I wanted the fierce with the rhinestones. So disappointed. But, you know, love is great. I'm happy to have love. That's that's neat. I'll probably put this on uh, a denim jacket. Then here's one more iron-on, the heart with the kind of an antique gold diamond. I thought that was so attractive. They had pink and they had blue, but I, I thought this one's neat. I like that. And then I bought uh, this, the cherries and the popsicle. That's so cute. These are neat. I, you know, I don't know what I'm exactly going to use them for, but um, yeah, I just think they're adorable. Definitely going to do it. I'm liking this iron-on stuff. And then I think the last item, yes, this is it. This is it. I bought these refills for my um, mop head that's square. That came out a month or so ago. And so I use, I'm use i using this telescoping handle. I love this. This is the mop head that Dollar Tree probably is going to get in again at some point. They don't have it now. It's funny how it comes and goes, some of these items. Anyway, I was curious how, what, how this works. It's a Velcro attachment on this mop head. So you just peel these on and peel them back on. Peel it off. Put it back, put it back. Anyways, using it to dust my Venetian blinds, you're gonna be horrified when you see this. Look at that, look at that. Ooh, I have a dusty house. Yikes. Anyway, having these extras, you can take that one off and wash it. I might hand wash it, get all that dust off, and then put on a new one. And then I got, uh, you get two per pack, which is great. So I've got two packs. That should do me just fine. We'll see how they wash up. I'll let you know. But that's my um, Dollar Tree haul. Yay, Dollar Tree. Hey, I'm sorry I had to do this twice, but um, probably took the fun out of it for you guys. But anyway, wishing you all the best. Come back and see me again sometime. Maybe. Bye-bye for now.